boys okay y'all y'all seen y'all know where that's from y'all know y'all seen the title and thumbnail it's ludwig now i'm sorry for all the charlie fans and all the other streamer fans all the pokemon fans i don't know what y'all watch i don't really know that many streamers but ludwig is my favorite one and in this video i'm going to tell you why but first you have to actually know who ludwig is because if you don't know who he is then what's the point of you watching this video Basically, in the very beginning, he started streaming on Twitch, and now he's on YouTube, so he kind of transferred over, and this happened a minute ago, probably like two, three, maybe four years ago, so it, went, it was a while ago. And he does a lot of gaming on YouTube because he's a YouTuber, he's a streamer on YouTube, and he does a lot of gaming. Some people even say he's the best YouTube gamer, if that makes any sense, or at least the best YouTube streamer gamer. Yeah, I don't know. It's just like the variance of different games that he plays. He's probably the best all around, if that makes sense. I'm, I don't know for sure. And the way that he proves this is doing bro versus bro. Now, it's not just him versus another guy. It's actually him versus someone else, either female or male. And then it's just a variety of people. It could be multiple people like he usually did Twitch versus YouTube streamers. And then he kind of did it with bro versus bro. But that's basically what it is. They just... 1v1 or like do like a battle in different games like chess valorant i guess minecraft you could even do it in but just di different multiplayer games or just 1v1s but don't get this mixed up when he was on twitch he had an a great time at twitch he was the second most sub channel or ch whatever they call it on twitch i don't know channel whatever because he's like right underneath the kai that which is kind of crazy that's that's a big that's a big thing they're in the 200,000s i think it goes kai ludwig and then ninja as the most subbed all time if that makes any sense i'm pretty sure that's the leaderboard so he was a big deal on Twitch, and the reason why he switched to YouTube is because he felt like Twitch didn't like actually like interact with him, if that makes any sense. Which is kind of strange because he was the second biggest with the subathon. Now this subathon happened a long time ago. He was basically streaming for 31 days or 30 days, I can't remember the exact time, but basically a whole month he was streaming his entire life. And he exposed on how much money he made, and let me tell you, it was multi-million dollars on just the subs alone and stuff like that, the donations. Now, of course, after the subathon, his subs did go down a little bit after the next month because he wasn't really doing a subathon anymore. And when you're at the very top, you can only go down, okay? So that's how what happened. But on YouTube, he does very different things. And then in this video, I'm going to describe, like what he does on streaming and what he does in videos and one of the main things that he does is storytelling now he does like it's i guess on streaming it'll be called chatting just chatting or whatever but he rotates into making it a video where he does storytelling the other thing that he does and what he's well known for is reacting to mr beast he does this every single time there's even people in the comments and in the live that are saying they only react they only watch mr beast's videos if they're reacting to ludwig reacting to Mr. Beast. It's a whole loop. It's the new meta of today. And he also does a lot of speed runs, or at least he did a lot of speed runs. There's not really that many games that are speed runnable, if that makes any sense. There's like only up and stuff like that. Minecraft, I guess, is a speed running game that you can do, but there's not really that many speed running games as of right now that are new, at least. There was that one god, like like Greek god one where they pushed the boulder that was a speed running game I guess but he only did that once and did not speed run it because it took him a long time to finish it I guess there's also uttering I guess he did that kind of uh yeah he kind of had a duo but it's fine and if y'all actually watch him and remember like a year ago he was obsessed with the button if y'all don't know it's like a tv reality no it's not a reality tv show it's more like a tv show where they like have a date and then you push the button you you switch out the other person and basically he was he watched those a lot he almost watched them as much as he watches the mr beast videos and now he's over here shooting threes like curry because he did a whole live stream of just shooting threes of 1000 threes which is probably like one third of what curry makes a day but it's fine so basically he's the biggest youtube streamer of my knowledge he, he he probably is if i had to guess he probably is because you go on his live he has 10 to twenty thousand viewers watching him I forgot about Speed a little bit, but Speed is just a whole different person. I don't, I don't know what Speed's doing, let's be honest here. He has so much, 
drama happening. I heard last time I heard he like ripped out his hair, like someone ripped out his hair and broke his ankle or something like that. I don't know, but it seems like there's a lot happening for Speed. And somehow Ludwig won a, a reward for streaming. I don't exactly know how because he specifically said that he doesn't know how because he had the worst year on streaming and still won the reward. People are saying that it was rigged because his girlfriend QT Cinderella um, rigged it because she is the person that does the whole event. But let's be honest here. He didn't want to win that reward. Why would they do that? It makes no sense at all. Oh, and we can't forget about his friend. His name's Nut. Yeah, they, yeah. I, I, like, look at that. That's I didn't make up that name. But anyways, now that you know every single thing, majority about Ludwig, I'm going to tell you why he's my favorite streamer. And that is because, yeah, I, I wasn't going to end the video right there. I'm not that mean. But basically, I like watching him because he's entertaining. He, he does good content. He uh, says big words that I don't understand. He knows what he's talking about, and I don't, so those two work out. Is my goal to meet Ludwig and to be a streamer on YouTube? Absolutely not. I do never. I did streaming for a long time, and I gained nothing from it, and I never want to do it again because it was like, like it was draining so much streaming like five to six hours every day on YouTube or Twitch. I'm just never going to do it again. It's just not my, it's not. I don't want to do it. But yeah, I enjoy watching Ludwig, and I just wanted to make this video to tell you that I enjoy watching Ludwig's uh, streams, videos, and all that stuff. But anyways, guys, I hope that y'all did enjoy me yapping. Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe. Peace out, guys.